Hi. Um, yesterday um, at my church we were supposed to have um, Hol Holy Communion, but unfor unfortunately um, things happened in the serv service yesterday that basically overt overtook that um, par part of the plan of that service, so we ended up not having um, Holy Communion that day. So. I, I, I just want to take, take this opportunity to share, share um, Holy Communion with my um, audience out there. Um, if, if you're a Christian, uh, I, mean, I mean, you can partake in um, where, wherever you are. Um, just like, I mean, if, you, uh, if, if you need the emblems, I would suggest getting, getting like a cracker or, or a piece of bread for, for the um, bread part. And, and, and and some and some juice and uh and or 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 a glass of water for the um for 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 the blood, blood of Christ and it's like let let let's pr let's pray to make sure, make sure we we prepare ourselves for Holy Communion t um, th this day. Uh, Lord God, thank you for um for for dying on the cross. Um, I pray, pray that you prepare our hearts for, for Holy Communion. Um, search, search our hearts. Um, expose every um, secret thing that that may, may be hidden in our hearts, Lord God. Any, every secret sin, Lord God, and they ex I mean, expose it so that we can f confess it and repent of it, Lord God, and just uh, cleanse our heart, hearts of all. Of, of, of all unrighteousness and impurity and cl clear my minds of any doubts, worries, confusions, and distractions and forgive us our sins in, in the name of your only begotten Son, Jesus Christ. Amen. Anyway, I want to share share with you this scripture um, before before we partake of communion. Um, it's um, 1 Corinthians chapter 11, st starting with verse 23. For I have received of the Lord that which I also delivered unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread, and when he had given thanks, he broke it, and he said, Take and eat, this is my body which is broken for you, this do in remembrance of me. After the same manner also he took the cup when he had supped, saying, This, is, this cup is the New Testament in my blood, this do you as often as you drink of it in remembrance of me. For as often as you eat this bread and you drink this cup, you do show the Lord's death until he comes. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and the blood of the Lord. But let a man examine himself, and so let him eat of that bread and drink of that cup. For he that eats and drinks unworthily eats and drinks damnation unto himself, not discerning the Lord's body. For this cause many are weak and sickly among you, and many are, are many sleep. For if we would judge ourselves, we should not be judged. But when we are judged, we are chastened of the Lord, that we should not be condemned for the world. And that's the that's the reason why. Um, if you want to take communion, you must must be part part of the um, of the um, entire entire, entire um, body of Christ of the body of believers that are are present in the world. I mean, if 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 you're if you're sick, um, the, the, this communion service is for you, and I I hope that um, you, you would be able to partake partake with me in this uh, this this special occasion um, as you walk, watch this video. Okay. And okay, this right here will will represent the um, the body of the Lord Jesus Christ and um, let's let's pray. Lord God, Heavenly Father, thank you for um, for the body of the Lord Jesus Christ, which was broken for us, for that we that we may be made whole. Scripture says that it's by, by by the Lord's stripes that we are healed, and we 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 pray for healing right now for pe people who, um, who who are broken in body and in spirit, Lord God, and just uh, and I, and I give you th thanks. In your son Jesus' name, amen.
Okay, now this cup right here is going to represent the um, the blood blood of the Lord Jesus Christ. And I, let's pray. Fa Lord God, Heavenly Father, thank you for the um, shed blood that your that your Son Jesus Christ um, sp spilled from fr His body on on a cross. Scripture says that without the um, shedding of blood, there's no forgiveness of sin. Um, Please cleanse us and heal us, Lord God, with with the um, cr crimson flood of um, that comes from Emmanuel's veins, Lord God. And so thank you for thank you for the blood that never loses its power, that that keeps us clean, and that we we can always come to you, Lord God, for for forgiveness of sins. That if we, that Scripture says, if we confess our sins, you are faithful and just to forgive us our sins and to cleanse us of all unrighteousness. And I give you thanks and praise in your son Jesus' name. Amen. <sighs> uh, and now I think it would be the appropriate time to sing a song. This is a simple chorus. And it was like, Thank you, Lord, for saving my soul. Thank you, Lord, for making me whole. Thank you, Lord, for giving to me thy great salvation so rich and free. And another song, and like, Oh, the blood of Jesus. Oh, the blood of my Jesus, oh, the blood of Jesus, it washes white as snow. Yep, that's pr that's pretty much it, and I hope you um fi find some cl cleansing today, and that you f if you feel um feel. Feel that your sins have been forgiven. That that um you, that you give thanks unto the Lord for um for er everything He's done for you. Uh, that you you didn't have to do a single thing for your salvation except to believe. And um and now and now that now that um we now that we come come to the end end of the um <laughs> communion service i i just want i just want to say um what it what it says in um sa sa says in um numbers um chapters chapter six um verses 24 to 26 um, may the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make his face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. And may the Lord lift up his countenance upon you and give you peace. Okay. So, that's pretty much it. Have a nice day, and may God bless you.